Hi, it's Rudy Fernandez, the One Arm Outdoorsman, and this time I don't have a camping tip for you. I have a tip that's going to help you stay alive or at least keep you out of jail or keep you safe. In 1997, the state of Texas agreed that we could paint a certain color on a fence post and it could mean the same thing as one of these, a no trespassing sign. As farmers and ranchers across the Lone Star State put these signs up to keep uh, trespassers out and keep hunters off their property. Well, they came up with an idea that a certain color would mean basically the same thing. And the law, when it first came out in 1997, said you had to have one of these signs along with posting purple. And that's, uh, posting purple is a certain color that uh, even colorblind folks can see. And the way the law has read for years is that you would have to paint the top of the fence post near the gates and all along your property line with this posting purple and it means the same thing. And then just a few years ago, they decided that they didn't uh, need to have the trespassing signs anymore because hunters and, and law enforcement folks and folks that are going to be out in the country are going to know what that color means. And uh, well, sure enough. I've been out with a couple of my friends here recently and they said, man, what's up with all these purple posts, man? People love the color purple. Know what it means. Stay safe and stay out of trouble. It's no hunting and it's also called uh, right here, it's the no trespassing. You can mark your posts with it. So if you see this and this color purple shows up on fence posts or gate posts, it means no trespassing, no hunting. Abide by it, it'll keep you alive in the Lone Star State and certainly keep you out of trouble. That's another handy tip from the One Arm Outdoorsman. And do me a favor, go out there, have fun, but be safe out there. Thanks for watching.